Here. Welcome to the Check Your Understanding um, for 3.3a. I mean, it depends which book you're using. But anyway, you're a marine biologist interested in analyzing the length of weights in Atlantic rockfish. You and your crew will be going out to catch rockfish to collect data before releasing the fish. Uh, you are able to collect data on the length in centimeters. So we have length in centimeters and the weight in grams for the fish. Here's a scatter plot and it has a clear um, curved form, nonlinear data. The length is one dimensional and weight like volume is three dimensional. A power model um, of the form weight equals a constant times the length cubed should describe the relationship. Here's a scatter plot of weight versus the length cubed. So if you cube the weight and compare it to, I'm sorry, cube the length and compare it to the weight. Because the transformation made the association roughly linear, we use computer software to perform a linear regression analysis of y equals weight versus x equals whatever the length of the fish was to the third power. And here's the regression analysis. Notice the notation here, weight versus length cubed. So we have our y-intercept, um, our slope. You have... Um, your R squared value, standard deviation, that's good stuff. Give the equation of the least squared regression line, define any variables you use. So the predicted Y or weight is equal to 4.066 plus 0 0.014677 times the length to the third power, whatever the length to the third power is. So because it's running a linear regression on this data, right? The length was cubed. So if you enter the cubed length, that's how you can predict the weight. And then you have your defined variables here. You could also write length in, what is it? Centimeters? Centimeters and grams. That would be helpful. Okay, next. Suppose you catch an Atlantic Ocean rockfish that is 36 centimeters long. Use the model from part A to predict the fish's weight. So you'll input 36. It gets cubed first because you're comparing the outputs to the cube of the inputs. And you get uh, estimated, predicted, 688.9 grams. So our estimated weight, predicted weight, when the... Length is 36 centimeters is approximately, or predicted, 688.9 grams.